Hi, my name is Rory Martin. I'm the National Sustainability Leader for DWP Suitors and this is my entry for the Future Green Leaders Award for 2014 for the Green Building Council of Australia. Three things that uh, drive me to work in sustainability are one, stewardship, two, is working in a fast-paced, ever-changing industry, and three, is working on good, intelligently designed buildings. First of all, with stewardship, I grew up in rural Ireland, where I enjoyed climbing trees, playing in the fields, or at the beach. Whether it's Ireland or Australia, one thing that is synonymous with anyone that enjoys the outdoors is our need to protect this for future environment. It is this stewardship that I feel that we all have a duty to protect for our next uh, generation. Um, the second thing that really appeals to me is the nature of the industry with which we work in. It is a fast-changing, ever-evolving, ever-innovating industry that is exciting and diverse. There is always something new, there is always a new challenge. I think being able to resolve these challenges through design and intelligence and working across communities is one of the great exciting um, privileges that we get to experience. And finally, the third thing that really appeals to me working in this industry is the passion with which I get to deliver. Um, working with communities, with developers, with all different kind of consultants, you see them all bringing their skills and their talents together and it's this cross-pollination of ideas and enthusiasm that really makes it exciting to be in the industry. For me I believe this is a question actually about looking at long-term impacts and short-term impacts. Yes we can design facilities that have uh, much better um, energy performance, um, you know, improved w uh, water consumption um, and you know, well-engineered solutions. However, I believe that the real focus here is on what the impact on the students is. I believe that if students can get an appreciation for what um, a good environment is, the quality of light that they experience, the quality of air, um, why they like these spaces, um, how they better interact with other students, that they get an appreciation for you know, environmental sustainability, social sustainability. Um, I believe these experiences then embedded within them will create a legacy by which um, they will understand these real values of sustainability as opposed to these buildings in isolation which just have nominal improvements. I believe that is the real way we can make educational facilities greener by impacting these students. Well they say knowledge is power so for me if I was Prime Minister, what I would do is I'd try and give the public the knowledge to deliver sustainability because with that then they would hopefully have the power with which to create a sustainable society. Um, for that to be, to be enabled, what I pr would propose as Prime Minister is that I would make sustainability a part of the educational curricul curriculum for students. Um, it, it, in the environment is somewhat covered in the um, earth and environmental science subject, but having it as a core subject of sustainability will open students up to environmental design of buildings and performance, also the social context um, of sustainability and also then understanding how it needs to work economically. Um, with, with this in mind, um, I believe that it would like enable the future farmers, manufacturers and designers to really understand the core areas and how it impacts their lives and what the tangible elements of sustainability truly are. Um, I believe that if you make this kind of part of the course and just something that is day to day and embedded within their life, um, it becomes less onerous than let's say imposing a carbon tax which does aim to deliver some quite admirable environmental solutions but because it is onerous it becomes a lot more difficult. Um, I believe that if this is something that becomes you know, embedded within day to day life um, just as part of the psyche then I believe that the passion will also be developed within the students so that they can express themselves and bring this into their professional careers.